He has spoken only to Times now because he believes that this is the channel he trusts. And now Siddhartha Das joins our editor-in-chief, Ornab Goswami. Over to you, Ornab. Thank you very much, uh, Anand, for that. And with me uh, from Kolkata now is Siddhartha Das. Uh, Siddhartha, can you hear me? This is Ornab here. Yeah, of course, I can hear you. Thank you. So, uh, did you, you are Indrani's first husband. Were you married to her? No, never. I was not married to her. Uh, where have you been all this while? Where have you been all this while? I cannot hear. Can you hear me, Siddharth? Yeah, I can hear you. So, where have you been all this while? While means, what do you mean by that? This whole case has been in the media for about a week now. Why haven't you come forth earlier? I was, I was very much in Calcutta. I was watching, I keeping a tab of all these things through the paper, through the media. Right. And the appropriate time came, I came in for word. What do you mean appropriate sorry. time? Sorry. Yes, please. What do you mean by appropriate time? Uh, yesterday they showed that I have went away to Bangladesh or something. Right. That's why I came here. Uh, when did you last speak to Indrani? Have you been in touch with Indrani? No, never. Since the last 26 years, maybe. 26 or 7 years, I don't know. Did I you... Have count back from have 1989. You, you know that Sheena is your daughter. You've known of Sheena being your daughter and Mikhail being your son. Yeah, that's right. So Sheena is your daughter and Mikhail is your son. Your daughter and Mikhail is your son. That's right. Uh, did you know that Sheena is gone missing? Gone missing. Missing. I came to know through the TV channels only that she was being murdered. What about the last three years? Did you know she was missing? No, never. I didn't, I didn't know. You had no idea? You had no idea. Yes, please? You had no idea that your daughter Sheena was missing? No, no idea. And you heard about it through the media first? That's what, that's what. For the last one week, Siddharth, the whole country has been asking, where is Sheena's father? Uh, why have you been, why haven't you spoken out for this last one week? That's what I told you before. Let the time come. I'll come forward. When the time has came, I came forward. No, uh, were you hiding something? Were you worried about something coming out? Why are you concealing your identity even now? I'm concealing my identity because I am working in a small company. I have a place where I stay. I don't want to bring a bad name. See, I have concerned because people will talk many things. Right? Right? Okay. So that's why you are concealing your identity. You claim that you spoke to Sheena when she was in class 10. Can you recollect the year? Was this before or after uh, Indrani's marriage with Peter? When did you last speak to Sheena? I told you when she was in class 10. That's all. And, and in what circumstances, please? How did you contact her in class 10? How did you contact her in class 10? To the number, they have a landline number. In Gohati? In Gohati? Yeah, that's right. Uh, what did she tell you then? Uh, what did she tell you then? Yes, please. What did she tell you then when you spoke to your daughter Sheena? Spoke to your daughter. What did she tell you then? How are you? What did she tell you then? Daddy, where are you? How are you? I asked her, how are you? I am fine. That's all finished. Uh, and what did she tell you about Indrani? No, I never asked her. Why she will tell me? I never asked about her. I was not bothered about her. No, under what circumstances did you speak to her? Speak to her. Speak to whom? To your daughter Sheena. Under what circumstances did you speak to her, Mr. Das? To know her welfare, how she is. And after how many years had you spoken to her? You said you spoke to her when she was in class 10. After how many years were you touching base with her? I cannot recollect exactly after how many years. It is a long back. See, uh, 25 years is a very big gap. Now, why did you suddenly speak to her when she was in class 10? Because it's not adding up. 
you suddenly just pick up the phone and you spoke to her, you asked her how she was in class 10. Was this after Indrani's marriage to Peter? I cannot hear you. Pardon me? I cannot hear you nicely. Sir, in 2012, she was about 23, 24 years old, right? So if you, if you spoke to her when she was in class 10, presumably that would be around 2001, 2002. So you spoke to your daughter after Indrani married Peter. Am I correct? I don't know that. You didn't know that Indrani had married Peter? I never knew all that. You didn't know that your that Indrani Mukherjee had married Peter Mukherjee? I never knew that. When did you get to know? Yes, please. When did you get to know that Indrani Mukherjee has married Peter Mukherjee? That Indrani Bora has married Peter Mukherjee? Through the media, the day it flashed. That is on the 25th, I suppose. I don't, I can't relate to it. You mean for the last 10 years, you didn't know that Indrani was married to Peter Mukherjee? Indrani was married to Peter Mukherjee? No, not from the last 10 years. From the last 25 years, I never knew where she was, what she was doing. And I was not concerned also. You were not concerned about Indrani. Presumably, you were also not concerned about Sheena. Sheena. I was concerned about the kids, not about Indrani. How prove to me that you were concerned about the kids? What did you do if you were concerned about the kids? What did you do to show your concern about your own children? To know their welfare, that's all. Do you to know their welfare when? How many times were you in touch? How many times were you in touch? In Twitter, the, that's what I told you. you know, when she was in class ten, last time I spoke to her. And Mikhail, I have never spoken till now. Then how do you say that I was concerned about the children? I'm sorry, but Mr. Siddharth Das, your various comments are not adding up. If you're saying that you're concerned about the children, one phone call to Sheena when she is in class 10, around the time that Indrani is getting married or is with Peter Mukherjee is not an expression of concern. You're not even in touch with Mikhail. How do you say you're in? It's not adding up. None of the viewers will believe you, Mr. Das. Um, what to say now? No, Mr. Concerned das, you must you explain. You are, no, no, Mr. Mr. Das, you say that you are very concerned about your children. There's one phone call that you make. You, is that concern? One phone call to your daughter after her mother gets together with Peter Mukherjee. That's all the concern that you have? Yes. I want to know about the welfare. No, are you are repeating that again and again. I want to know about their welfare, but what did you do to find out about their welfare? One phone call in 24 years? If you think so, what to say? No, I don't think so. You have, you have told my correspondent, Tamal, that you are Mikhail's father. You are also saying you're Mikhail's father. But your mother says she's not aware of Mikhail being your son. Why is she saying that? That I don't know why she told that. You claim in your interview to Tamal that Sheena Bora was born on February 11th, 1987. Am I correct? Am I correct? Yeah, of course. But I have a birth certificate from 2002 that lists her birthday as February 11th, 1989. No. I, can, I can give you the address of the nursing home where they were born. I know the address, the name. Both of them. Okay. Under what circumstances did you leave your children? I never left them. But they were adopted. They were adopted by Sheena's by Sheena's by by Indrani's parents. Indrani has given the consent. They never asked me. I never, I was not in touch. How do I know? You're, you're saying you were not in touch. At the same time, so you're saying you were concerned about the welfare. And there is one phone call when your daughter is in class 10. Concerned me, I want to know their welfare. How are they? Did you know that Indrani was introducing Mikhail and Sheena as her half siblings? Through the paper. Did Mikhail or Sheena ever tell you that Indrani is trying to conceal their identity? Through the paper I came to know. I told you before also. 
So you didn't know anything. There was one phone call. In, during that one call, go back, Mr. Siddharth Das, and tell me, during that one phone call, what did Sheena say to you? I told you, I can't repeat again. Was she Sorry. surprised that you called her suddenly? Yeah, of course she was surprised. After so many years, I called her. That was the first phone call you'd made to her, ever, after you left? After you left. Hmm. Was that the first phone call that you was made that to the her? the first phone call that you made to her? No, no, before also I had a call with the way they were small. They were small. They were quite small. Between uh, 89 to 92. Between 89 to 92, when they were 2, 3 or 4 years old, you used to call them? Used to call them. There was a long gap. And then for 12 years you went missing? Yeah. And Who then su you? suddenly you called her when she was in class 10? Yeah, that's right. Why? What happened? Why did you suddenly feel like speaking to Sheena? No. The grandparents does, does not want me to be in the, with, uh, touch with them. That's why. No, why did you suddenly call your call Sheena in cl in class 10? I felt like. You felt like. You felt like. Yeah. To know and, how she is. And, and subsequently you never tried to get in touch with them again. You were never in touch with them. Knowing fully well they are your children. Yeah, I was not in touch. Slowly, slowly, I departed. Slowly, slowly, you departed. There was one phone call. Did you ever try to contact Indrani? Why should I? I'm asking you. I'm asking you. No, no, sorry. I never, I told you once and I told you. That Did since 89 till today, I never saw her, never met her, never made a call to her. Did you ever meet Sanjeev Khanna, Indrani's ex-husband, who's also in Kolkata? I never met anyone. I never knew. Do you believe Where Indrani are, is capable doing? of doing this? Maybe. Explain maybe. Explain maybe. Yes, please. Explain maybe. I don't understand what you mean by maybe. Through the media I saw, whatever through the media I saw. Did you tip off the Mumbai police about this case, Mr. Das? No, 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 no. I never tipped off. Why, Why not? I, I Why knew. not, Mr. Das? Why not? Are you a law-abiding citizen? Why didn't you? I never knew that. I could, how could I tip off? Tip off? The whole country is taking your name. Your name is on every national newspaper for the last one week. How you were in hiding? Why should I hide? I was never in hiding. That's exactly what I'm asking you. Why were you hiding, Mr. Das? I was not hiding. You were aware of it? Didn't your, didn't your family members, those you are living with, everyone tell you your name is on every newspaper? There are reports of where your family is in Karim Ganj? People are trying to find out about you? Yeah, that's why I came out today. To face the media. So you came out when the pressure became too much? Yes, please. You came out when the pressure became too much, when you felt that you could not hide anymore? Hide yeah, that's what. So you thank you so much. Thank you so much, Mr. Das. Mr. Thank das. You so much. Mr. Das. Mr. Das. Have you has the have you yes. has the police reached out to you, Mr. Das? Has the police reached out to you, Mr. Das? Has the police reached out to you, Mr. Das? Reached out to you, Mr. Das. No, 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 no. Till till now they have not contacted me. Uh, Mr. Das, uh, just one question, please. When you made that one phone call, and it's very interesting, Siddharth Das, that you make only one phone call to your biological daughter in her entire life. You make one phone call, and that is around the time she's in class 10. Did you not think that obviously that information that you made that one phone call would go to Indrani? No, I have no idea. What are, you, what are you trying to indirectly pass on a message to Indrani? That you could be in touch with your children. One minute, Mr. Das. Mr. Das, one minute, Mr. Das. Take the question. Take the question, Mr. Das. Take the question, Mr. Das. Let Mr. Das take the question. That's interesting. Ladies and gentlemen, was Siddharth Das avoiding a basic question about the only phone call? to his daughter. He says that he was contacting out of concern.
The only phone call he ever made to her was he trying to send a message to Indrani Mukherjee that whenever he wanted, at his free will, he could get in touch with their daughter and potentially unravel the relationship that Indrani was trying to hide. I leave that to your judgment. This has been an interesting chat.